I asked 10,000 Roblox Doors players exactly who their least favorite entity was within the game. Especially with 14 entities currently within Doors and with over 700 comments to go through at the same time, it's time to truly reveal who exactly is the least popular character in Roblox Doors along with the bonus question at the end. Comment below who your least favorite is and let's see the results. So here is the pie chart with all the answers that we've been able to record thanks to all of you guys watching the video. It looks interesting, especially with two giant pieces of the pie followed by some small ones, but let's reveal the entity with the least amount of votes. That's right. Window got the least amount of hate from all the entities apparently taking 1.7% of the pie and 170 votes. I mean, it makes sense. Windows doesn't really do anything to hurt the player as they just stare at you. Though there are versions out there on YouTube where players were able to make the entity attack you interestingly enough. People are kind of trolling with one person asking if Windows stole the doors update, especially since they never go outside. But yeah, Windows, I'm pretty sure everybody loves them. Who is the next entity though? Back to the pie we go, and it looks like we have a tie between Glitch and Rush with both 200 apiece, which is crazy. Relatively no hate, except for a couple folks asking why Rush glitches so bad in most rounds. Which honestly sounds like a lag issue, and some people are still having trouble trying to beat him as well. As for Glitch, people love him especially since he can absolutely be a savior sometimes. But I guess on other times, he can also turn his back on you and pretty much ruin your runs as well. It's pretty much a gamble when it comes to him, but apparently not with just 2% of votes going towards the entity. This next one should be interesting, but in 4th place we do have Shadow hovering at just 2.2% of the total votes, which equates to a total of 220 as well. Honestly, not sure why people dislike Shadow more than Rush to be honest, especially since the entity doesn't really do anything at all. and. They are super rare as well, just a 1 out of 2000 chance behind any given door. Even the comments for the entity were funny with people saying the body is great? What the Shadow is just a texture? But some people also ended up getting Shadow two times in a row crazily enough. I mean it can be frustrating to play at least 20 rounds before being able to get a chance to even see him once. But I guess that's what you gotta do to see him in person. This next one's crazy though. This entity doesn't even play within the game. Yeah, the guiding light. And with 3.7%, that was good for 370 votes against them as well. It's just confusing how players hate the guiding light even though they try their best to help players out whenever they lose the game. And they also even help you out while you're making your way through the rooms as well. Somebody even said that the Guiding Light was actually the true enemy and that we needed to stop trusting them, but I do agree with this one. Why would people hate the Guiding Light at all to be honest? Regardless, this next one makes a lot more sense. Of course, one of the first entities made for the game would gather quite a bit of votes as well, and that is Seek getting 3.9% out of the total votes, which was 390 votes. I can see why people dislike Seek, especially since the chase scene for newer players can be a bit hard to complete, or even worse, whenever the doors lag and Seek ends up catching up to you in a mere couple of seconds as well. That's really annoying. Some people were still asking how to beat Seek though, to even reports of Seek cheating by no clipping through a barricaded door, which which kinda sounds funny. It seems that people are still having trouble with the entity, which could be why they hate him, but it gets worse. Officially at the halfway point, it looks like we have yet another major entity up on the list and this time it's Halt, gathering 4.7% of the votes, which was good for 470 in total as well. Not going to lie, I can't agree that Halt can be annoying, especially when it comes to the speedrunning community. They see Halt as a speedrun ender in most cases, since you literally have to slow down and stop. 
But yeah, this one makes a lot of sense as well with people saying that exact thing I mentioned during speedruns. But you also had many comments noting how many people loved Halt due to the fun minigame as well. But I guess there will always be a division when it comes to Halt, especially between casual and speedrunners. The next entity is a funny one and it's one you wouldn't even encounter much at all. That is going to be Hyde, which held 4.9% of the votes, which is equal to 490 votes as well. Again, pretty surprised that Hyde got more votes compared to all the other entities on the list. You don't really encounter them much at all, unless if you really try before door 50, it takes about 10 seconds to get them. Though after door 50, it is easier to get them. But people have commented on Hyde, saying that Ambush and Hyde are a dynamic duo to not be messed with, and also that they are an impossible combo for beginners. He even had someone roasting the entity, saying that it's the most boring and useless monster, funnily enough. Now I can see why people dislike him. It's because he can push you out at the worst times if you don't time your hiding. But of course, that takes practice and patience. Next up we do have yet another two way tie and that is between Eyes and Jack both holding 5.4% each which was roughly 540 votes as well. Jack having a 1 out of 20 chance of coming outside of the wardrobes can really be a nuisance especially when you're trying to hide last second from entities. And eyes, well, they can spawn in a lot, forcing you to look at the floor a lot too. You also can't forget about Jack's 1 out of 2,000 chance red room as well, especially since that is super rare, and many players still never had a chance to see it in person. The comments are very interesting for Jack though, ranging from people calling the entity useless and annoying when trying to hide, to people just not liking the entity at all for some bizarre reason. This one explains it perfectly. They got Jack in a closet and die by rush. As for eyes, people hate them especially due to lag or not reacting quick enough since it can take quite a bit of damage. Not sure about the Berber it mentioned in this one, but it looks like it's related to lag once again as well. Finally, an entity that I bet you guys would be able to relate to and that is Ambush gathering 5.9% of the total votes which was 590 in total. Ambush doesn't really need an introduction, basically rush, but they can go back and forth between rooms one to six times randomly. I bet the comments for Ambush are going to be crazy though. What? Ambush Senpai? That's freaking sus right there. People actually commented saying that they like Ambush since he can run back and forth to even people saying that they got Ambush at door 5 as well. Generally being a more difficult entity for beginners, it makes sense why it got placed higher on the list. But the third least popular entity is a freaking cute little spider. Timothy got 7.5% which was 750 votes man. Like what the absolute heck? Other than just chilling inside of the lobby, wishing you luck, and well, yeah, the jump scares, the comments are crazy. Timothy is so scary, he's my least favorite. Timothy is my least favorite mainly because he jump scares you and it's completely random as well. Honestly, Timothy is kind of annoying due to him appearing out of nowhere. Why does he even exist? But hey, at least we do have a Timothy fan out there saying that he rules. But who is the second least popular entity? Well, after gathering a staggering 14% of the total votes and 1,400 votes as well, the figure was chosen appropriately for this placement. Not going to lie, I freaking hated figure my first times playing the game as well, and I can safely assume many players had a hard time against him when the game first came out within the library. A lot of people commented about figure ranging from just hating the entity in general, especially when sometimes it can detect players even when they don't make any noises at all or catching you from behind. People also mentioned that he is the hardest monster to deal with as well as being broken multiple times throughout the game. It's true, the entity can bug out a lot, but it's kind of funny to see that happen. But of course, the least popular entity in Roblox doors. 
I mean, you guys should know it's that pesky little slime ball screech. Completely breaking the chart with 36.7% of the total votes meant that over 3,000 people voted for the guy and, well, that iconic sound just starts the whole train. Screech is annoying because he pops up unexpectedly. He's so annoying and I hope he oofs. What? Screech just sucks in general. Some people were defending Screech, saying that he looks like Baby Yoda though. I don't really see the similarity right there, but maybe by the face. That's interesting. Even the developers trolled Creecraft with like a million Screeches as well. And of course, you'd hate to experience that. Making Screech the least popular empty in Roblox stores by far. But it's bonus question time. I also asked the community which item do they buy from the shop the least, and the answers will actually shock you. Apparently, according to the survey, people bought vitamins the most from the shop while also buying flashlights the least as well with 30.6% out of the total votes. I mean, vitamins are very useful for speedruns, but I am surprised people didn't use lockpicks as much as the others. Very interesting take. 